Hey, what's going on, everyone? This is Pastor Benny, aka the Real Pastor. I just want to show you guys really quickly how it is that I am keeping uh, my minnows alive and uh, saving money. So, uh, basically, what I did was I went to Walmart and I paid for the styrofoam uh, cooler along with uh, this portable bubbler that came with it the bubbler does take uh, let me show you guys the bubbler does take D battery alright it actually won off of one but it uses uh, it, it uses these two for the one and a half volts and that kind of saves you on your battery so you're not spending a whole bunch of money on batteries but let me show you guys this again let me show you how I am uh, keeping my bait fish alive so basically what I do is when I get home um, I disconnect this from the bubbler and then I connect the hose to this hose which runs up to this beauty here I went to Walmart I spent about eight dollars for it but it's a uh, it's a bubbler for an aquarium all right and I just keep it plugged up here all right all right so just so I happen to have this set up and uh, I've got a little dust there should have cleaned that before <laughs> but anyway uh, so yeah and so I switched that over and uh, that's how I keep my water keep oxygen in my water while I'm home and to keep the water cool all right what you guys can do is any type of bottle uh, that you have um, you just basically fill it up with water and you let it freeze and that's going to keep the water cool for you now to take it a step further put that on there here I'll, I'll make sure it gets on there better <laughs> but to take it a step further you can actually uh, here I'll tell you what let me show you and so to take it a step further now you can actually uh, just freeze you some empty jugs now I was using these um, before I started using the setup that I have now because I was using a five gallon bucket right and I was also using uh, my portable bubbler so I was running uh, just run out of too many batteries doing that so voila I have my own supply of different water bottles and every now and then I swap them out switch them out and so that's what we have here got the cooler to keep the water cool for the minnows all right water stays cool all you need is one bottle at a time as you think about it and what I do is um, I switch it out with the lake water and so um, anytime I go fishing I go ahead and change that change that water out so I've had these minnows for the past uh, about three days now so they're still alive and so also what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop by Walmart in the morning and uh, I am going to uh, buy some uh, fish food so uh, yeah, I just wanted to share share that with you guys. Hopefully um, that may give uh, someone else some ideas on uh, how you can save money uh, on your bait fish. Um, the uh, minnows that I get, you know, they're uh, the places I get them from. They're about two dollars a uh, two dollars a dozen, and so I typically get about two dozen anytime I go swimming or excuse me, go fishing. And so you know, you times that by five, you know, you're looking. Uh, you're looking at twenty dollars a week, so you can definitely save your money uh, by doing this setup. Just going and getting you this bubbler from Walmart. It only cost me ten bucks, and then I also got this uh, this valve. I had to buy that separately, all right, um, from Walmart. And then whenever you're not fishing, again, you just hook that that valve up and you turn it on, and now you're uh, getting getting oxygen into um you're um you're getting oxygen to your minnows so all right guys uh, i hope that helps somebody out there and uh we're gonna go ahead and get out of here
All right, as always, if you stay in God, you will stay in control. And until next time, uh, happy fishing, guys. Bye-bye.